Okay, so here's how to create some quick collections in Lightroom that will automatically synchronize to Lightroom Mobile. So um, we're currently in all photographs in the catalog and I'm just going to move into collections and you will see that within collections there should be a collection called From Lightroom Mobile. So within that, you can create as many collections as you want. As you see, I've got a collection Note 9 camera, which automatically gets populated from the camera as I take photographs. Um, and I have a portfolio collection. So I'm just going to create a new one. So we go to create collection. I'm going to call it Norway. Put in some of my Norway images. I'm checked inside a collection set from Lightroom Mobile so that it synchronizes um, to the mobile device. And I'm going to set it as the target collection, which means that I can very quickly add images to it. So we'll just create that. And I have the collection set up and I can go to my folders, uh, go into my image library. I can go to photo trips. Uh, you know what? I just can't. It's not in my image library. Um, it's on my Samsung T5. Uh, I can go to Norway, I can select the Norway um, folder, I can um, uh, basically show photos in subfolders, and here are my Norway photographs. So I can go through these and pick the ones that I want to add by simply pressing the B key. So if I press B on that first one and B on that second one, they'll go into that folder that we um, just created. You could also click on the little um, circle which puts photographs into the target collection. So we can go around and pick as many as we want here. Um, and we've put a few in. So let's look back um, just in the collection set and go down to Norway. And we have it there. And all of those photographs are being synchronized onto your mobile device. So that should... Um, create an album on your phone that you can view, rate, edit, whatever you want to do. And of course the edits and the ratings and any other metadata get synchronized back to Lightroom um, CC Classic on the desktop.